it's Yvonne here and I'm going to do a quick sort of little video today. It's going to be a little bit different video. Uh, if you don't follow me already, my name is Yvonne and I mostly go to the Goodwill Outlet bins. I go to thrift stores. I go to secondhand shops and stuff. And I look for handbags and I look for accessories and clothes and anything else that interests me really. And so if you don't follow me already, follow me on my Instagram at Girl or E-D-I-T-A-G-R-L. It's the same for my Poshmark also. And go check out my Instagram because right now I have two beautiful coach backpacks that I'm currently selling. And they're both vintage. Yes, vintage. And they're beautiful and they were from my collection, personal collection. So go check them out. Also, that's what I want to talk about in this video. The new coach collection that came out. If you haven't seen, Coach came out with a collection of handbags, I believe uh, the day before yesterday. It's called the Coach Originals. Um, yesterday, actually, I think was the actual, uh, you know, runway show. But they have had a pop-up in New York that has been out for a while. And it's called the Coach Originals pop-up. And they just have all these vintage restored handbags. Some of them are new. Some of them are, like I said, are restored, and some of them are remixed. So, I'm just going to show you really quickly here on the Coach site. These are, this is some of the bags here. As you can see, the vintage is hot right now. It is coming in right now. So, yes, I think that these are beautiful. I'm just going to kind of scroll up um, quickly. But um, most, of the, most of the ones that are like a... Remade are still available, obviously, because those are new. Those are remade handbags. But the ones that are restored are more than likely already sold out because somebody actually restored these handbags. And so, yeah. I'm just going to show here. You can kind of pause and look at the prices. But uh, they have so many that are like restored handbags and just just beautiful beautiful handbags and these are the remixed handbags the remixed handbags are just kind of different okay these are the restored handbags I don't know why it said remix because these are actually the restored ones so you can see some of them are pretty pretty expensive on like those duffels and those Willis bags so yes and some of the little like dinky bags again are sold out So I don't want to go through all of them. But here's some of the remixed bags. As you can see, the remixed bags were just kind of remixed. Basically, it was like one handbag uh, made with another. It's not for everybody, obviously, but they are sold out already. So if you wanted one of those, they're gone. Um, but they have beautiful ones. And this is what I wanted to show you because this is kind of new. And, I, you know, I have right now two vintage coach handbags that I recently picked up and I want to show you. And these are the remixed handbags. And look at these. They have vintage pins and patches on them. These are duffels. These are little duffels. I do have two coach duffels. One of them is a newer one. Like a newer sort of, you know, not so vintage one. And then I have a vintage one. And it's uh, in that color brown. Just like this one here. It's in that brown color. Um also want to show you these these are like the uh, remixed uh, this is the stewardess crossbodies look at those so if you go on instagram and you look them up you'll see a lot of these vintage styles like this and they're just like made with the little pins and stuff and i just think that they are just so 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 fun because you know i had never really seen uh, anything like that this is kind of new and I just wanted to show you basically this new collection because I think it's awesome. And I also, because I recently got two vintage handbags. One of them I already had. I picked it up at the bin. I didn't know what it was called. So I started looking up uh, what it was called when I got it. And I couldn't find anything on it. So I was like, well, what is this, what is this little bag called? You know, I was like, hmm. 
And so when this new collection came out, I looked up, you know, the Coach New York hashtag um, just to see what they had in the bags and stuff on Instagram. And I found this girl. This girl, um, lady, uh, actually was the one who restored a lot of these Coach hat bags. And her name is Deb the Restorer, D-E-B-I, Debbie the Restorer on Instagram. So go check her out if you want to. And she has a website, and her website is called www.sacmagnifics or whatever dot com. Uh, her website will be linked, um, you know, in her Instagram. So if you're on there, you can look it, look it up. But these little baby, I found it on her website, and this is the Coach uh, Christy messenger bag. And I didn't know what it was called, and I had picked this up at the bin, and I had no idea what it was called. It just seemed it was cute. It has this little, like, little pull closure here that you just kind of pull, and then it opens up. No pocket on the back or anything like that. The, the strap is not adjustable on this bag. And uh, right now, I currently have this little coach uh, keychain on there from the outlet. Um, but I just, I just love this little bag. It's perfect. This is my bin bag. This is what I carry when I go to the outlet bins. Um, just because it's so much easy, you know, and uh, carefree. And I don't have to really worry about it. It's a very, very sturdy bag. And this bag on her website, because of course she restores it, makes it nice and new, um, is $149. Yeah, she has this bag currently for $149. And I want to say it was on hold for somebody, so... And here's the inside of the bag. I'm just going to do a little quick run through of what I carry in the bag. In the little zipper compartment here, um, you can see here's the Coach Creed. You won't be able to see it, but there's the Coach Creed. It's in there. Um, yes, and inside I have this little charger that I use for my phone. I also have the little cord that goes to the charger. This is so cool. I picked this up, I think, at a yard sale for like a dollar or 50 cents. It's really inexpensive, but it works because it's small. I also have my lip smacker in Coca-Cola. I always carry a lip smacker with me. Um, and then, of course, I have my beautiful little pouch right now that my mom actually thrifted for me. And uh, I have all my coins, money, etc., cards, whatever I need in there. Inside this little pouch here for the little zipper compartment is where I have my headphones. I took them today because I was accompanying my um, neighbor to a doctor's appointment. And I have my little keychain with my keys. And that's it. That's all that fits in the little bag. And if it's my phone too, I have an iPhone 8 Plus that fits perfectly in there. So I love this little bag. It's just so so perfect and so versatile so yes yes I love love this little bag so that is what I have but yesterday I went out thrifting with a friend and I found something that I had really really wanted uh, and I don't know if anybody really follows coach but coach had come out uh, a while back I think uh, maybe last year maybe at the beginning of the year maybe they had come out with the with the coach canteen bag and uh, it was a remake of it so it wasn't like the original or anything but i saw it and i was like i need the canteen bag i love it i've been wanting a round bag that is perfect but of course i was not about to pay coach prices for the handbag so i was like let's look on this pre-loved market so i did and i found one on on a poshmark but the girl never got back to me as far as measurements on that specific bag because there's a small and there's a bigger one. So I was like, well, okay, fine. So I just kind of left it. I didn't like, you know, she didn't get back to me. I was like, oh, well. So I just left it. And lo and behold, yesterday I found it. Ha! Here it is. The Kirt's Canteen Bag. And this, the, the girl currently, the one that is uh, restoring them, has this on her website for $149. Yeah, I love it for, I mean, you know, I love that she restores the handbags. I think it's great that she does that. But to be honest, I don't think I could spend that kind of money unless it was something that I absolutely had to have. And I would have had to have disposable income for that because there's just no way. So I cannot believe I found this little bag. It had been on my wish list. It is gorgeous. 
it just does I mean it does have a little bit of wear but this is a very nice sturdy leather it has a pocket in the front here's the inside the inside is beautiful on it it does need to be stuffed you know it's just kind of shoved around it has really nice thick leather like I said really nice hardware the strap is adjustable on this one so I love this little bag and inside when I looked at inside of course it has a little zipper compartment here but inside and you won't be able to see that I'm very sorry it does say made in the United States this is definitely a uh, an older piece from coach and I just fell in love it does have some wear here you can see like where the um, a leather color is wearing also on the bottom it does have some wear as far as the leather color the color of the leather but that is very easy to fix I have some uh, just some of that restore restore or black stuff that it's Hadrian uses and I'm I think it works great I mean and then it does need moisturizing I, I don't have any moisturizer right now so I'll be able to do that to it but it does need moisturizing but this is impeccable there's nothing wrong with it it just has the normal you know scratches the normal wear the normal wrinkling on the back you can see the beautiful wrinkling of the leather and I just I just love it I just love this little bag it's gonna be a great little bag for my collection and this is what I paid for it here's the little zipper pull by the way it's just a beautiful nice little zipper pull on there very nice and this is what I paid $5.99 I know $5.99 for this little baby I was like oh this little crunch bag is mine I was like it is coming home with me and I'm going to use it because I I like using a smaller handbag a lot of times and I get in this like rat row like hairy one bag for a while and then I'll just switch out so yeah so I think this is gonna be the next one I carry for a while and then I'll switch out but I definitely need to um, definitely you know give it some TLC and I think it'll be good to go but that's what I wanted to come on here and show you because you know if you have any of your vintage coaches or vintage handbags pull them up now is the time to be carrying those little babies and uh, yeah these are my two favorites like I said I do have two duffel bags uh, one of them is green and the other one is that brown color and that's the older one uh, I think I might have some other vintage coach bags but I really don't think I have any more uh, the other one that I do have that it is it's also vintage I have some like little accessories that are vintage um, and maybe I'll show this in another video but that's like the only thing really that I have as far as vintage coach goes I did have a lot of vintage coach in my collection because a lot of times I would go to the you know flea market and I would just find it and nobody really picked it up because everybody's kind of like oh I do have two vintage coach bags yes I just saw them over there right now I have to think um, and those are from the Bonnie Cashin collection those are actually the um, ones with the clip, the little kiss lock uh, pouch in the front. I have two of those totes. And believe it or not, I got those, each one, I got them for $3. Yeah, $3 at the flea market. Uh, like I said, nobody was speaking of vintage coat. Nobody wanted it for some reason. One of them I did get re-dyed and uh, rehabbed from this man that did it locally here. Um, in my opinion, I don't think he did a fantastic job, but what are you gonna do right so uh <laughs> but i mean it came out good it just you know i would have done it a little bit better job on the um because some of the the edging on mine was kind of worn off and he fixed it but it looks like he fixed it you know and i would have liked it not to look like he fixed it so those are the two bags that i have and i and i i'm gonna start carrying those for fall so yeah but i'll show those in another video because they're over there but if you want to follow me here, make sure and comment, like, and subscribe so you don't miss any of my videos. But other than that, that's just what I wanted to talk about. This new vintage coach handbag craze that's coming out because I think it's fantastic. I think we should all pull out our old Willis bags or our canteen bags or tote bags or whatever we have. Our um, duffels because they are back with the vengeance. And that is what everybody's going to be carrying for fall. But that's the video. I'll see you in the next one.